this is icf coach and here you can see this icf coach bogey in this bogey used bogey mounted brake system the brake beam used the both side of the wheel and the brake cylinder is mounted the both side of the bogey next if you see the lhb coach brake system then it is disc brake system the disc is mounted with the axle one more here you will see the brake caliper unit and brake cylinder next this is wagon brake system so this is a single bogey of a wagon here you will see the brake beam assembly but here you will see only the inner side of the wheel or bogey there is no outer side brake beam or brake beam assembly and one more here is no brake cylinder the brake cylinder is mounted under the wagon here you can see the brake cylinder the wagon brake system works based on the mechanical arrangement a single brake cylinder control the both side bogey brake system so today in this video i will show you the differences between these three brake systems so my name is chiranjit and you watching let's grow up let's see the video so let's start with this icf coach here you can see the icf coach and the back side this is a bogey in this bogey first of all you will see two brake cylinder the brake cylinder is connected with this bp pipe and this is a bogey mounted brake system where the brake is mounted to the bogey and the brake system works based on a mechanical arrangement so if i see a single brake beam assembly normally you will see so many things this is a single brake beam assembly here this is a brake beam assembly and this one is the brake head and this one is the brake shoe the black color portion here is the brake shoe here you will see the both side two brake beam assembly and this is work based on the mechanical arrangement of the brake cylinders next this is the lhb coach brake system these are the pipes the pipes are connected with the bp pipe these two pipes are coming through this main pipe main pipe this one also called the branch pipe and this pipe is connected with this under slag brake control unit this is the branch pipe again the branch pipe or flexible pipe and this one is the brake cylinder and the outer part of the brake cylinder this one is connected with the brake caliper unit and brake shoe this one is the disc disc is mounted with the axle and this one is the axle so next is the wagons if you see this single brake beam assembly you will see the same parts like brake beam head and brake shoe also there brake beam assembly so these are the key parts i remove all the things this also a mechanical arrangement a mechanical brake system this is the push pull rod and the rod is connected to this brake cylinder the front side of the brake cylinder rod and the back side of the brake cylinder rod and the back side rod is connected to this rig here is a push pull rod and then here is a mechanical arrangement the front side of the brake cylinder same is connected is a, a rig here is a adjuster this is called the slag adjuster and then the push pull rod here is a mechanical arrangement the same part in a wagon you can see only one brake cylinder and the brake cylinder maintain or control the both side push pull rod that's why the both side bogey brake system works in lhb coach you can see the more safety 
every wheel you can see the single brake cylinder in a bogey there is four brake cylinder so in ICF bogey you will see two brake cylinder so in this bogey you will see two pipes one is green pipe and white pipe so green is BP and white is FE branch pipe via isolation cork dart collector and non return bulb the air enter this auxiliary reservoir the output pipe is here this one enter the DV output pipe from the DV again this one is the pipe connected the both side bogey if you see this bogey the same pipe is here right isolation cork pipe flexi pipe and then this pipe and the pipe end cap here you will see the two pipes this one is the branch pipe and it is obviously flexible pipe pipe is connected to this brake cylinder and finally the brake cylinder works based on the compressed air and then the rig system of this brake works in LHB coach the brake system control by this brake control unit first auxiliary reservoir there is two tanks one is brake system and this one for toilet system these are the both side bogey pipe these two pipes are connected the both side bogey brake system from this pipe this one T joint and branch pipe here is the flexible pipe the pipe is enter the both side brake system this pipe here is once again flexible pipe and enter this brake cylinder so the other side same flexible pipe and brake cylinder one more pipe going the next axle flexible pipe brake cylinder again this pipe flexible pipe and brake cylinder two pipes one is FP and BP both are connected with this loco pipe green is BP and white is FP the hose pipe are black color you can see this but only the coupler ends or angle cock cut up angle cock you can see the color in wagon here is only one pipe which is the BP pipe that's why it is called the single pipe brake system but nowadays in wagon also you can see the two pipes one is the BP pipe and AP pipe so the white color is AP pipe and green color is BP pipe so in this coach or in this wagon you will see the two pipes AP and BP right here the AP pipe is used to quick store the auxiliary reservoir and the BP pipe used for brake application during its operation need air that's why the AP pipe used additionally here is the triple valve joint and branch pipe isolation cock dart collector and enter the auxiliary reservoir output pipe enters this DV here is two pipe one is for control the BP and second pipe is enter this brake cylinder when the BP pressure is dropped from this BP pipe that's why this pipe is here and DV sense automatically it apply the brake system through this brake cylinder so when the brake cylinder works this mechanical system push or pull the rod and then the brake beam assembly contact with the wheel this is very basic fundamental system of this brake system but I am creating a video proper animation how this wagon brake system works so if you want to learn more about the brake system 
then definitely share your comment thank you so much already there is two video one is LHB coach and ICF coach in the screen I will share the screen shot of the videos and also you can check out the description box how ICF coach and LHB coach break system works or you can check out the upper link thank you so much if you want to learn more about the brake system, definitely share your comment.